Welcome to Fighting Stats, the ultimate channel for MMA fans who love statistics and betting breakdowns. I'm your host, Art C, and I'm here to get you ready for the upcoming UFC fights. In this series, I'll be watching tape and providing my real-time analysis on how I think the fights are going to go. I'll be watching for fighters' strengths, weaknesses, tendencies, and overall strategies, pairing that with Fighting Stats' exclusive UFC stats not available anywhere else to give you a prediction on how I think the fights are going to go and, ultimately, who's going to win. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Welcome to Fighting Stats. Welcome back to Fighting Stats. I'm your host, Art C, and today we are continuing on with the fight tape of Armin Sarukian. <clears throat> Here he takes on Joaquim Silva. Sarukian will be a minus 1050 favorite, the number 8th ranked Sarukian. Um, Silva going to be the plus 700 underdog here. So Sarukian going to have 3.5 inches of reach advantage. Uh, Silva going to be 1 inch taller, and uh, Armin going to be uh, 8 years uh, younger as well. So. Decent run so far that we've seen for Armin Sarukian. If that in that last fight we saw him take on uh, Demir Ismagulov, winning a unanimous dis decision there. Uh, so now he comes in here, eight and one as a UFC favorite. Only the one loss that we've seen was against uh, Matthias Gamrot in a five round fight. Uh, that fight going back and forth here. So let's get this fight started. Let's see what this one is all about here. All right, here's Joaquim Silva, big guy in the white trunks. Uh, Sarukian uh, red trunks here. Both guys open up orthodox. Minus 1050 favorite, man. How's he going to cover this price here? Let's see. Uh, Armin goes lead high kick early. Another kick to the body there for Armin. Nice outside low kick. As soon as you throw an outside low kick, uh, Armin is going in trying to catch that late kick. Looks like he's going to reverse. No, nope. nice nice job by Armin uh, keeping the top position there. Uh, but against the fence, Armin usually tries to put the legs between the legs and hook the legs, uh, trying to prevent the butt scoot there. But uh, looks like Armin's trying to get the butt out from under the cage. Going to move him parallel to the fence here. Armin working this takedown four minutes left in round number one. <coughs> uh, Silva using a right overhook on that left side of Armin trying to get up uh, Armin doing a good job of preventing him from getting up let's here fast forward some of this again trying to take that right post away from uh, Silva Nice flatten him out there. Again, moving parallel against the fence so he cannot butt scoot or cannot push against the fence. Grabs the leg. <coughs> so back to full guard. Nice big elbow there from Sarukian from top. Nice, another nice elbow there for Marmon. So yeah, Joaquim trying to grab the position and control the posture of Armin here. When you're not controlling the posture, he's trying to get up. He grabs Sarukin grabs the back. I'm gonna try to kick him out, kick the feet out from under him. Sarukin on the back. Nice job from uh, Armin here, keeping the fight down on the ground. Silva trying to throw some back punches. <coughs> Grabbing the wrist there, he's okay. Working some body shots. Trying to get that uh, that choke in. Here, just fast forwarding some of this position until he gets out of it. <coughs> sort of a stalemate here, a lot of three minutes so far of back control time. 
Silva using the fence here to prevent uh, Sarukian to get behind him though. Still working this position. So it's four minutes here of back control time, seeing if anything changes here. Still has that one hook on, on that side and Silva's still using the fence to prevent the other hook on the other side. Fast forward, drags him back down to the ground. 20 seconds left, Harmon's still working this position. <coughs> Grabs the hook, all right. Nice elbow, nice knee to the body there from Armin. Nice elbow there on the break. <coughs> all right. So clear uh, Armin round. One nothing for Armin here. Don't know if we see any replays. It's just a lot of control time for Armin here. So. Round number two. Armin Saruki and Joachim Silva. Both guys orthodox still standing. Armin backing up. Goes lead high kick again, another kick to the body. Right, big right hand misses there from Silva. Outside low kick there from Sarukian. Kick to the body there again from Sarukian. One, two lands from Sarukian, ends with a kick to the body. One, two, kick to the kick. Yeah, and he's, uh, I like, again, how he ends every combo with a kick. Well, you saw one, two. He was out of range on the two. Ended up with the uh, left high kick. <coughs> one, two there for Armin. Fainting a level switch. Right uppercut there for Armin. Nice elbow in close there from the clinch. Silva trying to post off. Armin not giving a ton of room here to work. Goes inside trip, doesn't get it. So yeah, uh, Sarukin trying to grab the uh, outside trip, doesn't get it. Back to the center of the cage, three and a half left in round number two. Silva outside low kick, <coughs> nice right hand there. Oh, Silva landed a left hand here. Check left hand. There and landed there. One, two, three there from Sarukian. Outside low kick there from Sarukian. Kick to the body from Sarukian. Clinch in here. Nice right elbow on the break. Nice duck under there from Armin. Right hand to the body from Armin again. Right hand, double right hand there. Nice clinch, nice knee up the middle from Armin. Right hand lands from Silva. Kick there again. Armin trying to grapple. Right elbow there from Silva. Nice jab there from Armin. Another right hand there. Ooh, let me see this one. So, so steps into it. Lands a right hand, Silva goes left hook, lands a left hook again. So both guys ten uh, landed there. Oh, axe kick. I love that axe kick. Over one and a half gets there. Right hand there. Nice knee from Silva. The over one and a half was plus money in this fight. Interesting. Posting off, a nice knee to the body there from Silva. Silva circling off. Two minutes left in round two. Coming forward, right hand lands there from Silva. Left hand from left elbow from Silva, a little bit short. Left hook there from Armin. Nice outside low kick from Armin. Left high kick there from Armin. <coughs> Right uppercut for Armin. Nice left hook there from uh, Silva. One, two lands. Oh, he got rocked there. Ducks under here. Uh, Silva throws a, a big left hook over the top. Wobbles Armin here. 
He's landed that left hook a couple of times here, right? So let's slow it down here. He comes in. Blocks the incoming strike there. Armin with his hands up, right arm down. Throws that left hook clean. That was a big power shot. Armin wobbled here. But he's working through it. He grabs the clinch. He's in on a takedown. Able to clear the cobwebs. Gets the takedown. He had him rocked. Even that, that was the worst case scenario for Armin. He saw him get rocked. And uh, still able to get uh, work through it. Get the takedown. Now he controls the rest of the round here in full guard. Uh, one minute left. So it gives time for Armin here to recover. He's going to start. Oh, nice elbow there from Armin. He's not even taking this last minute off. And uh, Silva has some power too. So he landed that big left hook there. So in terms of damage now, it's probably 1-1, one, one, right? Oh, a nice right hand from uh, Armin. Armin just looked to try to set up this arm triangle, but he's not in close. He's still full guard there, so he's never going to really get it. Hand on the mouth here a little bit. Armin good. Oh, that was clean. That was clean. A wobble a little, little bit. Stanky leg landed a right hand over the top. Armin struggling there. And then remember, he got rocked. That was clean rocked. And then he got the double leg, got the takedown. So... <coughs> Decent showing from Armin. That was the cleanest we've seen him get rocked. We've seen him get hit a couple of times, uh, but that time he got rocked. Round number three. Silva taking a big step up here against the eighth ranked Sakuki. Nice kick to the body jab. I like that uh, kick to the body jab that he does. Always throwing multiple strikes. Another axe kick for Armin. Another kick to the body there. Silva throwing some big punches, sitting down on them. Right hand, another right hand there. Goes outside trip. And on the clinch, working the clinch here. Again, it's probably 1-1 one, one here because of the big rock there. So um, Silva going to need some big moments here. Sarukian looking for the takedown, grabs the takedown right into side control. Steps over into half guard. So le let me, hold on, hold on. So he fell into side control, and then he tried to step over. Uh, and then he's still on side control but on the other side or sorry half guard 3 or 4 on takedowns trying to take that left post away Silva's pretty heavy on that post so he can hang out there here Silva has to give up the post back down to those butt <coughs> right over hook here from Silva sorry left over hook 3 minutes 20. I'm going to see if Sarukin just controls him for the rest of this fight. Uh, watch for these elbows here from on top from uh, Sarukin. Silva reverses. <coughs> Silva on the neck. S or Sarukin on the neck. Back up to his feet. 2 minutes 45 seconds left in round number 3. Still anybody's fight here. I think, again, 1-1. One, one. Uh, Sarukin had a lot of control there, but uh, Silva's going to need a couple of big moments here to steal the round. Spinning back fist kick to the body there from Sarukin. Nice. Nice kick knee to the body there from Silva. Another knee catches the knee, drops him. Some of big elbows, big elbows here for Armin. Look, look, he can't even get the hands right, and now he has to go back. Look like he could have finished it there. Couple of short right hands here. He's gonna go elbows soon, I think. Yeah, hammer fist there from Armin. Oh, there's the elbows. Oh, the elbows are so damaging. Oh, gonna flatten him and back out again. Moves over to side control. Looked like he could have had the arm triangle if he wanted it. Silva gives up his back. Worth noting that Armin did not go rear naked choke here, and now he is. 
flying them out here still going with the ground and pound still ground and pound back to mount Sarukin rolling with Silva here F hammer fist hammer fist hammer fist oh yeah, now it's done good uh, Armin Sarukian with the third round TKO ground and pound finish uh, I guess that's pretty live here right nice knee catches the knee here drops him down on his back into side control then he goes yeah this is just over at this point he could just go Donkey Kong um, again worth noting Silva rolls to give up his back Armin doesn't like default go to rear naked choke he just continues with this ground and pound uh, gives it up eats big damage there so uh, Armin Sarukian covers I don't know if he covers but was, he was minus 110 uh, sorry minus 1050 coming into this fight ends up winning by the third round but it was close so I don't know if he covered that price tag uh, definitely ended up winning so we got one more fight to go and then we'll move on to the Charles Oliveira side at UFC 300 my name is Artsy this is Fighting Stats thanks for watching alright guys well that is it for today thank you very much for watching if you like this type of content make sure you smash the like button hit the subscribe uh, you'll get notified anytime we put out new content listen to this we just hit a massive parlay for $29,000 at UFC 297 that is one UFC after 296 where we hit a parlay for $82,000 that's back-to-back -back parlays. We've made $110,000. And how do we do it? We use our exclusive fighting stats. Not available anywhere else. Our exclusive fighting stats gives us information, gives us a big edge over the sports books, and tell us what's going to happen within the fights. We post all that information, our breakdowns, our best bets, over at patreon.com slash fighting stats. Don't miss out. Make sure you subscribe today. Again, my name is Art C. This is Fighting Stats. Thanks for watching.